The Pixel 7a along with the 7 Pro is one of the best smartphones in the world right now because of how much you can do with it. Like, did you know if a spammer calls you, your Pixel 7a can talk with them instead. This is such a cool feature and it's so simple. If you get a phone call, all you gotta do is tap on this new screen call icon and here's what they'll hear. Hi, the person you've reached is using a screening service from Google. Go ahead and say your name and why you're calling. As soon as they speak, you'll actually see exactly what they're saying and you can then get your phone to respond right to them if you think it's spam. Please remove this number from your mailing and contact list. Thanks and goodbye. But you can take calling another step further by tapping on the volume button and this live caption icon. Now, whenever someone calls you and you answer it, if you tap on caption call, it'll transcribe every single thing they're saying, but then you can respond by typing out your response. So you don't have to chat with them on the call and here's what they'll hear. I only use an air fryer, leave me alone. And to make sure you can use the typing option to reply, just head into accessibility under live captions and make sure to toggle on typed responses. Honestly, I can see my Myself using this on way more people than just spam callers, if you know what I mean. Okay, now you guys have got to try this next feature out because it just blew my mind. It's found within Google Maps and basically what happens is if you search for a well-known landmark, like Big Ben for example, you'll now start seeing this option below called Immersive View. And when you tap on it, you get an amazing 3D immersive view that you can rotate around, zoom in on. It's basically like a 3D replica of the entire area so you can just look around. And as you can see, it's already working on a few other popular landmarks and cities from around the world and literally every time I show this to someone, they are absolutely mind blown at how cool it is. But what makes this feature more amazing is if you tap on this time and weather button, it brings up a timeline of the day where you can scrub through and actually see what the weather or lighting conditions are going to be like. You can skip forward a couple of days to see those weather conditions, especially like if you're planning a trip and want to see if it's raining. And for certain attractions, you can even see what time of day is the busiest by checking out this orange bar. And if you want to see the most popular pixel feature, then stick around till later. But for now, let's navigate to some new hidden features. Features. So this next feature is super nifty and I'm so glad they finally bought it to the 7a. It's found within settings under privacy and security. Then under device lock right over here you get face unlock. It is really simple to set up and you just gotta follow the prompts on the screen so it can scan your face but once it's set up make sure you toggle on skip lock screen because what this does is it automatically unlocks your phone to the home screen as soon as it detects your face without you having to swipe to unlock. Another little tip is if you prefer using the fingerprint scanner then I suggest you add the same fingerprint twice like your thumb because as you can imagine adding the same fingerprint twice will definitely make the fingerprint scanner more accurate but another new feature inside display settings that's an absolute must is smooth display this is actually off by default so make sure you turn this on because it just makes your screen feel so much smoother and way more responsive the cool thing about the 7a is it also comes with wireless charging which you can kind of see on the speaking case but yeah the previous pixel a range did not have wireless charging and this is a first for the a range so just slap it on a wireless charger and the bang you can charge the Pixel 7a wirelessly. Now that's power, but what is also power is this next tip. Now I absolutely love widgets and the most powerful one of them all is the battery widgets. <laughs> but this one's especially cool because not only does it display the battery of your Google or Pixel products, but of other Bluetooth devices and it instantly updates as soon as they disconnect, which is super useful. Because I don't know about you guys, but there is nothing more frustrating than going to listen to your favorite tracks just to find out your buds are dead because you didn't keep an eye on their battery. And speaking of music, if you tap on the Android system section, you'll find this awesome now playing widget that you gotta add to your home screen because this is where you'll find a list of all the songs your 7a has detected playing around you. You do need to make sure this is on so under sound and vibration then now playing just toggle on identify songs playing nearby. Now whenever there's music playing around you your pixel 7a will automatically detect it and display it on the lock screen. You can also tap the music icon to favorite that song. Pretty groovy but if that wasn't groovy enough for you then check this out. Now, not many people know about this, but Recents actually has a few hidden features. Like for example, if you tap and hold on any text from any application, you can select that text and then choose to copy or share it straight from Recents. And if you're browsing Instagram or the internet and see this icon in Recents, once you tap it, you can instantly save that image to your gallery and open it up. This also works with sharing links. As soon as you open Recents and see this link icon, if you tap on it, you can choose to copy or share that link via message 
messages, email, or WhatsApp. And another thing you can do is if you click and hold down to highlight a phone number, straight away you can call that number, which is so nifty. Hello? Yes? I haven't spoken about the cameras yet. Well, let's actually get into that. So the first thing you gotta do with your camera is actually inside the Photos app. If you tap on Library, then Utilities, right over here, you get a locked folder option. Once you've set up your locked folder with the pin and all that jazz, there's a super hidden feature you can find within the camera. All you gotta do is tap and hold on the Photos icon, a secret menu will appear, and here you can select the locked folder option. And now any picture you take in the photo app will automatically be added straight to your locked folder and not kept in the main gallery. That way, you don't need to worry about moving pictures from folder to folder this just does it all for you super neat the camera also has a brand new mode called long exposure and basically what this mode does is it makes every moving object blurry like trains traffic streams or waterfalls i tested it myself with this pic and i was super amazed with the results there's also another new upgrade inside the selfie video mode once in here you can just tap on the settings icon and toggle from fhd to the awesome new 4k option and you can turn this on to get crispier selfies videos. And I know I didn't mention anything about that massive 64 megapixel camera on this bad boy, but that's because it's on by default, so every single picture you take is guaranteed to look awesome. Okay, because this is a Google phone, of course it comes with some sweet Google features. Like within sound and vibration, under vibration and haptics, you can turn on adaptive alert vibration. And basically what this does is it automatically manages the vibration intensity for you. So if your pixel is in your pocket or a bag, it'll actually detect that and increase the vibration intensity to get your attention. But if it's on a table or in the open, it'll decrease the vibration because chances are the screen will catch your attention. But another cool pixel feature is found within network and internet settings, right at the bottom called adaptive connectivity. And what this does is it automatically switches between 4G or 5G based on the app you're using in order to save battery. So 5G for streaming and gaming, 4G just for navigating your phone. But something that'll save you even more battery is inside battery settings called adaptive charging and battery. Make sure to turn both these on because this will actually bump up your battery's life by a little bit, but more importantly, it'll actually increase the lifespan of your battery by a couple of months and possibly even years. But I think that's enough of Google managing your phone. Now let's see how good it is at being your bodyguard. Now, the Pixel 7a has some really cool security features that you need to know. And the first one is found within security and privacy under privacy dashboard, which shows you a breakdown of which apps are using your location, camera, and mic. So if you tap on location, not only does it show you the apps, but also the time of day they accessed your location. You can also see this info with camera and even the microphone. But here's something even cooler you can find in the Google One app. If you open this up and scroll down right over here, you get a free VPN. To use it, all you gotta do is activate it right over here and now you're pretty much ready to go. You can also toggle it on in quick settings, which is even easier and just such a cool feature. Basically, what this does is it makes your Pixel lock and encrypt all your internet browsing so that no one can see it or steal it. So make sure to turn this on. And if that's not enough protection, just click the volume up and power button because then you get lockdown mode. This is especially useful if you're someone who likes leaving their phone lying around and don't want anyone to get in. Once you turn this on all your lock screen notifications disappear and there is no way anyone can get into your pixel without knowing your pin. But besides being an awesome bodyguard, your Pixel 7a can also be a pretty darn good assistant. So believe it or not, this is one of the most popular Pixel features because so many of you guys seem to love this. Within your Google account settings, if you scroll down to Google Assistant, in here you'll see the option Quick Phrases. Make sure you go ahead and toggle both of these options on because now whenever you get a phone call, all you have to say is answer to pick it up without even having to touch your phone. Or if you have an alarm going off, all you have to say is stop and it'll automatically stop. And other than those quick phrases, here are some quick tips. 
Now, this is something I've never seen another phone do, but on your 7a, if you type out a message to someone and include their names, followed by an emoji, right over here, you can actually create a custom sticker based on the message you just typed out. This does only work when the message is short, so keep that in mind. But another thing you can do with Gboard is once you've typed out a message and added some emojis, right over here, you'll see this little magic wand. If you tap on that, it'll actually remix the message you just wrote to spice things up a bit. Then you can just hit save. Another pretty exclusive feature you'll find on the Pixel is found within auto rotate settings. Once you turn this on, right over here you'll see this option face detection. And I really wish other phones had this because what it does is it uses the front facing camera to see the orientation on my face and whether it should rotate the screen or not. Simple, but genius. Something else that's really genius is that the recording app can now automatically detect different speakers when recording a voice clip. As soon as you hit the transcribe button, you will now see different speaker labels and an almost perfect transcription of what was just said. You can even see the speaker markers in the audio playback and this is honestly so useful. As you can see, the Pixel 7a is packed with a ton of amazing features. And don't forget to like and subscribe because we just hit 1.5 million subscribers. So now we're on the road to 2 million, baby. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Toodles!